Hey guys, if you're planning a visit to Disney's Animal Kingdom, then you need to stay tuned. I'll be ranking two of the most popular quick service locations at Animal Kingdom to help you decide which is most worth your Disney dollars. But first, hi, I'm Holly and welcome to It's a Great Disney Day. If you're new to the channel, be sure and hit the subscribe button and the little bell so you know when I upload my weekly videos. Okay guys, let's do this. Today I'll be ranking Flame Tree Barbecue and Satuli Canteen based on factors that are important to most people. The food, the value, and the atmosphere. So let's start with the food in Pandora's quick service location, Satuli Canteen. The menu here consists mostly of a large variety of customizable Satuli bowls. These allow you to customize your meat selection or tofu, your base and your sauce. The meats are grilled and they have a really good smoky flavor and they're always tender. For dessert, they have the blueberry cream cheese mousse or the chocolate cake. They're both very light and refreshing. Okay, so let's hop over to Flame Tree Barbecue and check out their options. Here you're going to find a large variety of smoked meats like a rack of ribs, a half a chicken, or pulled pork meals served with baked beans and coleslaw. Now some other entrees worth mentioning are the baked macaroni and cheese and the plant-based hot link sandwich. I've been eating here for years and I have never had a bad meal, but I can say the same about Satuli Canteen. So it's really hard to decide on which location is the best. They're both excellent. But due to the large variety of options at Satuli Canteen, I'm going to give them the first point for best food selection and taste. Now let's talk money. If you'll be using the Disney dining plan, you'll want to order the most expensive item on the menu, of course. This makes us feel like we're getting our money's worth for what we paid for the dining plan, right? At Flame Tree Barbecue, the most expensive item is going to be the ribs, chicken, and pulled pork sampler for $19. At Satuli Canteen, your highest priced item is $17, and that's the combination chicken and beef bowl. So on the dining plan, I would give the point to Flame Tree Barbecue for having the most expensive entree. But for those who have passed on the Disney dining plan, they'll be looking for the most food for their dollar. At Satuli Canteen, the slow roasted sliced grilled beef bowl is $12.49. With either one of the desserts, it's going to be a total of $17.78. The amount of food you get will fill you up without stuffing you. At Flame Tree Barbecue, the half chicken dinner is $13.29. Now, while the desserts are not that great, the side dishes are really so good, you should not miss them. My favorite is the french fries with pulled pork and cheese. Oh my gosh, they're so good. If you add that to the half chicken, you'll be spending $20.59. Now that's a $3 difference from the meal you get at Satuli Canteen. Now even though you spend a few more dollars at Flame Tree Barbecue, the amount of food that you get makes up for more than a $3 difference. In fact, I'm going to throw in a holly hack. Now surely I'm not the only crazy person who does this. I always bring in Ziploc bags in my park bag. So whatever food I don't finish, I put it in the bag, stick it in my backpack, and I eat it later when I get back to the resort. And I do usually take this back during a midday break. So I'm not keeping this food out in my backpack all day in the heat. So for the best value, this point has to go to Flame Tree Barbecue. So our last category is atmosphere. With Satuli Canteen being located in Pandora, of course it's gonna be highly themed. But more importantly, it's indoors, which can be nice on a really hot day. However, it can be a little loud inside and the lighting is kind of low. Also, on a really busy day, it can be hard to find seating. At Flame Tree Barbecue, the seating is outdoors, so that can be an issue in the extreme temperatures or if it's raining. 
There are several pavilions that have ceiling fans and the area is very peaceful and gives you a break from the masses. Now the best part of the atmosphere at Flame Tree Barbecue is the view of Expedition Everest. And for that, the best atmosphere point has to go to Flame Tree Barbecue. So for a quick recap, Satuli Canteen won for the best food options, Flame Tree won for the best value and atmosphere. So Flame Tree Barbecue is the winner, but you really can't go wrong at either place. But let me know your opinion. Which one do you like best? Or which one do you want to give a try on your next visit to Disney World? Leave your comments below. And hey, if you feel like this video was good in helping to plan for your next trip to Disney World, give the video a thumbs up and be sure and hit the subscribe button. Well, that's going to have to do it for today, folks. And until the next video, wherever you are, have a great Disney day. See ya!